quick question for all of you guys on YouTube social media. <laughs> Why do you guys fear success? Why do you guys fear the illusion of losing something? Especially when you know you have nothing to lose. <laughs> How you guys doing? This is your main man Raheem Smith, aka the self paid prince, coming to you guys with another quick video. And uh, the background you are seeing, don't worry about it. Things are a little topsy turvy. I'm at my job right now, just chilling out, doing my own little bit of work. Excuse me for a moment. My main reason for making this video as of right now is because I had something else I had to try and get off my chest. This is the camera. Yeah, right now I'm at my job just spraying, cleaning, that kind of stuff. And one of the things I was wondering is why do people fear success? If you guys follow me on social media, on on YouTube, you guys understand what I'm talking about. People who are not interested in starting a home-based business for themselves, but they'll work one or two jobs in order to get ahead. It's just plain crazy. It, it doesn't make any sense. People would rather work for somebody else than get together in a collective group and find out if they can put all their talents together. I think that's a little off, don't you think? I mean, Think about it like this. According to Rich Dad Poor Dad, Robert Kiyosaki's book, we're all on the left hand side of the quadrant, which is the E's and the S's. What you want to do is trans, uh, transfer, slowly transfer from one side of the quadrant to the other, which is the B's and the I's. If you're just working one or two jobs and you're not trying to transfer from one side of the quadrant to the other, you're doing it backwards. I'm sorry, you are. And nothing against 401ks, ETFs, CDs, and stuff like that. Nothing, uh, nothing against any of that stuff, but that stuff is good for the long term. And sadly, there are too many people who think long term. Do you? I mean, if you're going to get two jobs, at least get two jobs, both that pay, a, 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 a good wage, of course, a good hourly wage, but then find you a small home-based business that you can actually get into Learn about it, promote it, sell some of the um, sh uh, show and offer some of the products out, and then try to make a living that way. And even if you don't make any commissions or any extra money or any extra currency, whatever the case you want to call it, at least the fact that you have a membership and you can document everything and you can give it to your CPA or your um, attorney or whoever does your taxes for you for that year, at least you can get some extra because the government often offers up more money for you for starting a home-based business and trying to keep the economy running. Yes, that's correct. You guys think that, oh, if I run a home-based business, I'm not going to make any money. Well, that's impossible because if you start a home-based business, then you're trying to start an economy shift. You're trying to help the economy. You're trying to help people get jobs. You're posting ads all over the internet which is what people on network marketing campaigns do. And you are trying to help this online marketing job to get, um, to get customers. And for every customer that you enroll into this home-based business model of what kind, whatever suits your boat, you are able to make a small commission, if not more, depending on the business you choose to get into. So how is it a scam whether or not you make money throughout the days, weeks, or months when after the year is up, you're able to get more money from the government just from trying to build something from scratch. And yes, the government does offer you money, a ton of money for starting a home-based business and trying to raise a profit and trying to enroll people into a job like that and helping them to better themselves. It's called home economics, it's called personal growth, it's called entrepreneurship, it's called having having equity in what you do and being proud of it. See, right now, what I'm doing, I'm making somebody else rich, but I'm only gonna get a small paycheck, which is a small piece of the profit compared to the boss who owns the business that I'm a part of, if that makes any sense. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this little bit of education. Hope if you guys have any comments, uh, please respond on social media, like, share, comment. If you're seeing this on YouTube, like, share, comment, subscribe, hit the little bell icon. Look forward to seeing you, look forward to hearing from you. Happy New Year, love, peace, namaste.